I'd uh, like to share a poem with you. Uh, the poem is about the heart of God's love for you and for me and for all the people in the world. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son so that whoever came to him would not perish but have everlasting life. Uh, you know, God's love is so, so amazing. Uh, I'll tell you just a, a, a little bit. Um, I was a mess. My life was a mess. And uh, one day, I had enough, and I started to cry. And God, I cried for three days, by the way. And God's love, it was like God opened his heart and poured in so much love that I knew it had to be God. I knew it was Jesus. And there aren't words to describe, but I know that I know that I know God's love is real in Jesus. Uh, what I don't know is why people are afraid to come to Jesus when his love is so amazing. And I think it's because people don't know. They do know God's holy, and we all know that we aren't. And, and so that's perhaps the reason why some people don't come to get to know God. So this poem was written in response to that question, why don't people understand God's love? So uh, I'm going to read it to you now. called boldly come near the heart that cries holy heaven will hear proclaiming with love that Jesus is here here now to hold you here now to hear faithful in love he drives out all the fear faithful to cleanse you he bids you come near, making you bold by the power of blood, lifting you up to the Father above, into God's presence, enfolded in love. Uh, again, I want to say God's love is so amazing. And you don't have to be afraid. You can come to him today, right now, because Jesus died on the cross for our sins and for all the times and the ways that we messed up. And that removes the fear. So today, you can come to know Jesus. You can come to know his love. You don't have to be afraid. You just need to pray a simple prayer. You need to believe in your heart that Jesus is the Son of God, that he died on the cross, that he rose, after three days to pay the price for your sin and if you believe that in your heart and you say it with your mouth you can become a child of God today the decision is yours and I'd like to tell you that if you make that choice to know Jesus you will not be sorry your heart and your life will change uh, I don't say all your problems will go but Jesus will be with you in every problem and he will love you and he will change you and heal you and remove your fears and your pain. Little by little or sometimes a whole lot at a time. But your life will not be the same. So I invite you today to give your life to Jesus, to know his love, to know the Father's love and to become part of the family of God. So thank you. And if you want to pray a prayer, come and see anybody on the team here. We have red t-shirts. Any one of the people here would love to pray with you. So, in Jesus' name, I hope you will be a brother or sister soon.